Hello and welcome to this A1 Beginner Lesson 37 with me, Kate. Today we will be looking at some common adjectives. Let's get started. Listen and repeat. Slow. Slow. Happy. Happy. Young. Young, beautiful, beautiful, poor, poor, busy, busy, dangerous, dangerous. Okay, so here I have some pictures. Some are from now, some are from a hundred years ago. We have picture A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So in these pictures, can you find some young people? Where are some young people? We can see young people in G, there are some young people in E and B. What about poor people? Can you find poor people? Yeah, in picture E you can see some poor people. How about new buildings? New buildings. At certainly picture A, we have some new buildings. What about a busy road? A busy road. Here in picture C, you can see that it's a busy road. Also in picture F there, that road looks quite busy as well. Another busy road. What about happy children? Where can you see some happy children? That's right, picture B, these children are certainly happy. There are lots of happy children playing a game. Where can you see a slow car? A slow car. Well, in picture F, this is an old car. So maybe quite slow as well, a slow car. And in picture C, this is a very busy road with lots of traffic. And so there are lots of slow cars in picture C. Where can you see a beautiful place? A beautiful place. Well, for me, I think picture D is a beautiful place, but you might think picture A is also a beautiful place. And the last one, a dangerous road. Where can you see a dangerous road? Yeah, I mean, picture F and picture C both look quite dangerous. Picture C, because it's so busy, um, but we have two dangerous roads. So when we're using adjectives in English, the adjective usually goes before the noun, not after. We say young people. We don't say people young, for example. We also don't pluralize adjectives. For example, here I have one slow car. Here I have a lot of slow cars. I wouldn't say a lot of slows cars. I don't pluralize the adjective. Okay, so let's look at some more adjectives. Quiet. Quiet. Old, old, rich, rich, unhappy, unhappy, fast, 
fast, ugly, ugly, safe, safe. Okay, so now we're going to look at opposites. Here we have lots of common adjectives, young, slow, happy, beautiful, dangerous, poor, busy, and new. On the other side, we have quiet, fast, old, rich, safe, old again, ugly, and unhappy. You can pause the video if that helps and see if you can find the opposites. So what is the opposite of young? Old, young and old. What is the opposite of slow? Fast, slow, and fast. What is the opposite of happy? Unhappy. Happy and unhappy. What is the opposite of beautiful? Ugly. Beautiful and ugly. What is the opposite of dangerous? Safe, dangerous and safe. What is the opposite of poor? Rich, poor and rich. What is the opposite of busy? Quiet, busy and quiet. What is the opposite of new? Old, new and old. Okay, let's have a look at some photos. Here I have two photos, both of Trafalgar Square in London. This first photo is of Trafalgar Square in London a hundred years ago. And this second photo is of the same place, Trafalgar Square in London, but now in 2023. So if we look at these pictures, we can see they are both beautiful places. Trafalgar Square is a beautiful place. We can see that in this picture, there is a busy road and lots of busy people. And it's similar in this picture. I can see some red buses and lots of busy people. Now it's your turn. Here are two more pictures of London. We have the first one, which is a hundred years ago, and the second one, which is a picture of now. Can you describe something in this picture? What could you say? Well, you could say that in this picture, there are lots of beautiful old buildings. What could you say about this picture? What's in this picture? There are lots of tall, new buildings in this picture. Okay, let's try another one. Here I have a picture of a road near London 100 years ago. And here, this is a picture of the M25, which again goes around London, and that's a picture from now, 2023. Can you describe something or in this picture for me? You might say that this is a dangerous car or a slow car or an old car. What about this picture? Can you describe something in this picture? You might say that it is a busy road, a dangerous road with lots of new cars. Okay, well done, that's it for today. Before you go, I have a task for you. In the comments below, can you think of a cold country, a rich country and a hot country? 
And what's your country like? Can you describe it? Is it cold? Is it rich? Or is it hot? Thanks very much. Don't forget to subscribe and show your support. And coming next in lesson 38, we will be looking at the use of the words was and were. Thanks so much. Have a good day. Goodbye.